Here are few knowledge based questions on dot and cross product of vectors. Consider the vector u and v in 2D or R2. Write an expression for each of the following products if valid. Explain if the products are not valid. So the first one is u dot v. Second is u cross v. And the third one is u times v. Now you need to write down the answer and then look into my suggestion. Take it kind of a review test, right? Now my suggestions are u dot v. Now in R2, u dot v is very well defined and u dot v, you know, is magnitude of u times magnitude of vector v times cosine of angle between them. And if the angle is theta, then it's cos of theta. Now u cross v, u cross v is u v sine theta but it has a direction and the direction of u cross v is perpendicular to both u and v. That means it cannot be contained in R2, right? So therefore, this is not valid in R2, right? Since this product u cross v is a vector which will be in a plane perpendicular to R2, it will not be contained in R2. Therefore, u cross v is not valid in R2. Now, the third one is u times v is kind of a product which you normally do in mathematics or algebra. Now, this is undefined statement. So, this statement is also not valid in vectors. Right. So, they would write u cross v. Correct. So, now remember this that when you are writing u dot v in in R2, then we are looking for a scalar product. But when you are writing u cross v in R2, then it has no meaning. And similarly, u times v has no meaning in R2, even otherwise. In vectors, we have only two types of products which are u dot v and u cross v, and the third type of product which we have is a scalar multiple, right? So let me write here, scalar multiple. That means k times any vector, which will be a vector, right? So this is in short, this is like, this is in short our understanding about dot and cross product in R2, right? Similarly, I'll have the other video which will be in R3. Go through it so that your concept is absolutely clear. Thank you.